Hey guys, Matt here, and today we're going to be unboxing the Cooler Master Hyper T2. So this is the Cooler Master Hyper T2, and this is an aftermarket heat sink for your processor. And this is one of the cheapest Cooler Master heat sinks you can buy, but it's 10 times better than your stock one. And so this supports the LGA 1151, LGA 1150, which is what I have, and the FM2 Plus side. On the front, you have a picture of the cooler. On the side, you just have some dimensions. On the back, you also have dimensions. So if you want to see it, it's right there. This side, just a picture of the cooler. Now on the bottom, nothing. So now let's cut the slit, like so. All right, pop this off, and it all right, and this is everything that comes in the box. So here you have some silica. Don't eat that. Um, let's put that off to the side. Here you have instructions on how to mount it. And you have your accessories box, which is all the mounting hardware needed. So you got your... All of it. As well as some thermal paste in a bag. This should be just enough thermal paste to get this situated. Here you got your clamps. Here you have the mounting hardware. And that's that. And then here you have the cooler. So this is the cooler. This is a 140 millimeter fan by Cooler Master and I probably shouldn't be doing that. And you can swap these out if you just take these clips off. You have a nice black cable so that way it looks more discreet. Not like the one Intel gives you where it sticks out. On the bottom you have where it would go on top of the CPU. On the back you have a bunch of fins and you have dual copper pipes for cooling. Thank you guys for watching. This has been my unboxing and overview of the Cooler Master Hyper T2.